Hello there. Well, I had quite an eventful night last night and uh, basically uh, someone with inside knowledge of the Bethels in New York approached me with information that would help me to get in touch with members of the governing body. So I was a little bit sceptical as to how easy it would be to just ring up a governing body member, but I followed the instructions anyway and lo and behold, Late in the evening my time, it was about midnight, but it was six o'clock in the evening in New York, I managed to get straight through to Tony Morris. So, <laughs> which uh, I think you'll see from this clip how, um, how taken aback I was, but it was absolutely astonishing. We had a, a brief conversation that did not go how I expected it to go. And enjoy the clip. Yes, please. Oh, hello. Is that Brother Morris? Yes. Oh, hi, Brother Morris. It's Brother Cedars here uh, from the uh, laundry room down on Building 3. Uh-huh. We were, a few of us were talking between ourselves today, Brother Morris, about the branch meeting talk. And we were thinking about, you know, uh, tight clothing, yoga pants, that kind of thing. And we were thinking if we find some pants that are maybe too tight or some yoga pants. <laughs> Should we get in touch with you and let you know? No. <laughs> Talk to the branch committee. The branch committee. Uh, and, and don't let and me maybe... see don't let me see you guys wearing them. Well, and I was Are I was you serious? Well, you you pull, you're pulling my leg. Well, well, what if we find your your pants and your pants are a bit too tight? Should we Then you must have you must have shrunk them. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, no, seriously, I, I'm a huge fan of yours. Um, oh. I, I think that the that the, the talk you gave at the branch meeting was really helpful in waking up Jehovah's Witnesses to how outrageous the organization well, is. The loud, um, yeah, well, what's your name again? Uh, my name's Lloyd, uh, L yeah, Cedars, but I, I write under the name Lloyd Evans. Lloyd Evans. I don't know what, yeah, yeah. Where are you, at Walk Hill? No, no, I'm in. I live in Croatia, but I'm originally from the UK. Um, you sound I, British, yeah. Yeah, and I. Where, write, where are you I'm, calling from? From I'm calling from my home in Croatia at the moment. Come on, and they and they get you through there, huh? Well, uh, yeah, you know. <laughs> you have connections. Somebody let you through. It, 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 mu it must be Jehovah's hand, mustn't it? Yeah, yeah. Um, so yeah, it's just nice to talk to you, and and honestly, um, I, I I am a fan of yours in a way. Um, I, I think that you're very deluded, but you are helping to wake up people. I've had people who've emailed me and contacted me and said after they listened to your talk, it was the last straw and they had to walk away because it was just so outrageous. So um, I'm very grateful to you for that, personally. <laughs> He's on <hung> up. <laughs> So, wow, <laughs> um, I wish I could let you all know what it felt like when I heard hello <laughs> from Tony <laughs> and realised my dastardly scheme had, uh, had worked. But wow, that was an incredible experience. I, I'm not sure I will ever have that opportunity again. I hope I do, but I'm very doubtful that I will. Um, there's a few things there that I found very interesting. I wasn't expecting Tony to be in such a good mood, a, a good humoured mood with my prank. Because he, he very quickly identified that it was a prank call. It took him a while to figure out that I wasn't a Bethelite. Um, in fact, the majority of the phone call, he think, he seems to think I'm a Bethelite. I'm pretty sure I wouldn't have got that far if, if he'd have known who I really was. But I, I found it interesting that he was laughing at himself over the, uh, the whole tight pants thing. Because just to give you some kind of context, here is what he said on the issue of tight pants to an audience in Rome. Don't you know they love it when you're wearing tight pants? And you don't know that when you're wearing tight pants, you're wearing tight pants, and you're wearing tight pants. Oh yeah, you chuckle. I don't think it's funny. I think it's disgusting. 
disgusting. So for an audience of Jehovah's Witnesses, he's telling them it's no laughing matter and that tight pants are disgusting and they're not to joke about it. But with someone who he believed was a Bethelite, he was all, yeah, you know, having a laugh about it, which I found very, very odd indeed. Um, laughing about the whole my Jehovah's hand joke as well. That was odd, because surely he should be taking the whole Jehovah's Hand thing very seriously. And uh, yeah, it was, um, it's almost like there are two Tony Morrises. There's the Tony Morris who kind of laughs and jokes around with Bethelites who are teasing him. And there's the Tony Morris who gets up on the platform and is full of righteous indignation for, for what he's telling his audience. So really, really odd conversation very strange but so glad I had it and so glad I had the opportunity to tell him in person that I think well not in person but over the phone tell him that I think he's deluded and isn't it interesting how quickly he hung up after he after you know I got real with him but uh, yeah I hope you found this video interesting I will try and see if I can do something similar again I can't make any promises obviously and um, before you ask, no, I can't give out Tony's number. Um, two main reasons. One is I don't want three and a half thousand subscribers inundating Tony with uh, phone calls. That could very quickly turn counterproductive. And um, the second thing is that if I were to divulge the methods that have led to me making this phone call, it might make it even harder for me to do it again. In fact, I'm already fairly convinced that that Watchtower will um, heighten their security, as it were, make it harder for me to do this again, but I'm still going to try. So anyway, I hope you found this video entertaining, and as always, thank you for watching.